हाई एवरी वन सो हैप्पी न्यू ईयर इज अबाउट टू कम एंड पीपल आर मेकिंग रेजोल्यूशन कि मैं ये कर दूंगा मैं वो कर दूंगा आई रीड लाइक वन फिफ्टी बुक्स आई मेक लाइक फाइव करोड आई मेक टेन करोड्स वी डू दिस एवरी ईयर एंड नथिंग एक्चुअली चेंजेस इन आर लाइफ सो ऑन दिस वीडियो वट आई एम गोइंग टू डू इज दैट आई एम गोइंग टू स्पीक अबाउट सर्टन हाई वैल्यू स्किल्स दैट यू कैन एक्चुअली लर्न टॉक अबाउट स्टेप वन दैट यू कैन टेक स्टेप वन इज द मोस्ट क्रिटिकल एस्पेक्ट बिकॉज आप स्टेप वन अगर अच्छे से ले लो देन योर लाइफ एक्चुअली चेंजेस दैट इज अ स्किल दैट यू एंड अप बिल्डिंग वन क्विक एग्जाम्पल देयर वुड बी दैट फॉर एग्जाम्पल मेनी ऑफ अस मेक द रेजोल्यूशन दैट यू नो वॉट आई एम गोइंग टू पिक अप लाइक हंड्रेड बुक्स एंड आई एम गोइंग टू कम्प्लीट हंड्रेड बुक्स और आई एम गोइंग टू रजिस्टर फॉर फिफ्टी कोर्सेज एंड आई एम गोइंग टू कम्प्लीट फिफ्टी कोर्सेज कितने हो पाते हैं हाउ मेनी ऑफ फिट आर यू एबल टू रीड और कम्प्लीट The answer would be very, very few. So tell me honestly about it, about your resolutions in the comment section. So on that note, in this video, I am going to speak about high impact, high value skills for 2024. Some of these skills I am personally learning, and I will show you the roadmap, at least step one that you can take in order to fix those skills for you that would allow you to make more money. Because money making is nothing but an integration of the skills and knowledge that you have. Also, by learning these skills, you can improve your outcomes in terms of the Money that you will make, but it is equally important to safeguard your risk, especially given all the volatility. For example, these days you would have seen that the inflation in the economy is somewhere between five to seven percent. When it comes to medical inflation, it's close to fourteen percent. So therefore, it becomes very important for us to have insurance at a young age because premiums are going up like crazy, right? So let me introduce you to Trade Sponsors, which is Ditto. It is an excellent insurance buying platform. I have purchased my insurance from Ditto, and they are a wonderful platform. You can speak with the team of experts there. You can schedule your free phone call. It's very important to understand how to buy insurance these days, simply because of the fact that there are so many complications in terms of buying it. Let me ask you a simple question. For example, if you are considering that you are buying a term insurance and then you are figuring out that okay, should I buy it till the age 60 or till the age 80? Now people would typically buy it till 80 years, but by that time your kids would have become much older. They might not need that support, but you will unnecessarily pay a lot of premiums between the age 60 to 80. So knowing these basic points are very critical. So on that note, do speak with an insurance expert. You can do that via Ditto, absolutely free of cost. So do check the links in the description and comment box and. over to the main video the first key skill that you need to learn in order to make money is core communications now schoolon mein sikhai jati hai cheez again but uh, you know the practicality is not there now why do you require good core communication skills it's very simple that whether you are starting a business whether you are working in a job whether you want to manage a team whether you want to give instructions to anyone or just generally be on youtube speaking with others you need to have solid communication skills now communication skills are made up of three parts one is speaking reading and writing now the interesting bit that most people do not tell you is that all these three things are linked for example i am a professionally trained writer right i really enjoy writing writing is like my first love so to say videos happen for me great well and good but for me ability to structure my thoughts write it really well it allowed me to think structurally if you can speak in structures whenever you are reading stuff then automatically your brain become more structured so to say so all these things are interconnected that is a central point that i am trying to establish this is part 1 of the story part 2 of the story is that see if you enhance your communication skills not only is it ubiquitous right it is applicable has wide applicability what it allows you to do is that it allows you to duplicate your work duplicate in the sense is that for example i make videos on youtube right so that's one source of income stream so to say now i can write books if i am an effective writer now that becomes another source of income i can do podcasts that becomes another source of income i can coach people if i am an effective communicator so to cut the long story short irrespective of what you want to do your first money making skills is going to be effective communication so then comes the question that hey how do we develop and inculcate this skill what is literally step 1 okay so there is a very good book called as the mckinsey way and it teaches you how to write so if you pick the writing thread so to say first then automatically you will become more structured with time it's a little bit of a boring book but yeah say lo thoda right i mean learn read that book the second key thing that i will recommend to you is called as feynman technique now feynman technique in simple terms means something like this here you can see that basically you pick up a complex topic you absorb it whatever you can 
and then you try to teach it either to you or to others if there is clarity it means that you have understood that concept if not go and reread it so that is how you will become an overall much more effective communicator the second key skill that you need to develop is called as analytical skills now in school mein, college mein, everywhere they keep on speaking that analysis skills are good you need analysis skills are good you need but what is the meaning of analysis skills and how do you go about cultivating it now this is an answer that i had to figure out after working in management consulting and going through a lot of things right so let me simplify that entire concept for you analytical thinking in very simple word means that when you read anything for example if you are reading this book this is a 200 page book right and you go through this 200 pages book and you have just summarized everything how do you put it in frameworks and how do you think mathematically about this book and apply it to your own life that is what analysis means analysis ka matlab hota hai vishleshan in hindi it simply means that you are reading this you, there are multiple viewpoints that you might be able to discover out of this book so how deeply do you think about it are you putting some mathematical frameworks to it thinking about things deeply that is what analysis means it's a very critical component very critical skills log kya karte hain people will just simply read through this book aapne words pad liye english ke right i mean what is the point of just reading english words you have to think about things right so let me give you an example from this book called as 0 to 1 just to illustrate this point further for example in this book there is a concept that has been explained about 0 to 1 business and 1 to n राइट अब जीरो टू वन बिजनेस क्या होते हैं लोकलाइज बिजनेस सो टू से राइट दीज आर स्मॉल बिजनेस जैसे कोई आपने स्टार्टअप डाला राइट एंड दैट बिजनेस यू जस्ट स्टार्टेड टू बिल्ड अप राइट सो इट्स अ स्मॉल स्केल बिजनेस राइट फॉर एग्जांपल आई एम बिल्डिंग माय चेन ऑफ एयर बी इन गोवा सो इट्स एट इनिशियल नेशन स्टेजेस अभी मैंने खरीदे हैं थोड़े बहुत एयर बी एन बीज आई एम कन्वर्टिंग दो इन टू यूनिट सो दैट्स अ जीरो टू वन बिजनेस फॉर मी राइट नाउ नो लेट से दैट आई टू टेक इट फ्रॉम वन टू एन राइट नो वट वुड दैट मीन इज दैट नाउ आई एम एक्सपैंडिंग आउट ऑफ गोवा आई एम एक्सपैंडिंग इंटरनेशनली ओयो टाइप का कुछ बना रहा हूँ I will not build something like Oyo. My Airbnbs would be much more comfortable and all that. In case you want to check out, I'll put the links in the description box. But I hope that you got the perspective of zero to one and one to n means. Now see, ये तो आपको knowledge मिल गई इस book से, right? Now how do you contextualize it? So now you need to go into the specifics of things. कि अच्छा यार zero to one type के business भी होते हैं, one to n भी होते हैं. Now which type of business would suit better for me and why? Now in my case, I would look at my personality, look at where i stand in life right now how much money can i invest in terms of starting a business whether i have team management skills mujhe badi team banani hai nahi banani hai flexibility chahiye mujhe ki nahi do i want to take vc funding or not so these are all important criteria or points that i will try to fit and analyze whether starting 0 to 1 would make more sense to me or 1 to n so i hope that you got the concept of what analytical skills are now let me very quickly talk about the first step of cultivating this analytical skill the best thing that you can do is that you pick up an interest area and do analysis on that for example agar aapko technology ka shauk hai you want to learn about new technology or you like reading business books like these so you can pick up the story there right read this more concretely google karo expand your knowledge base in that then you will be able to see things from different perspective and analytical skills aa jayengi so on that note you can take step 2 also which is that you can write specific analytical based exams or prepare for exams that help you become more analytically aware for example in india you can take an exam like cat that can help you become more analytically aware so the next money making skill that i would recommend you to pick is called as problem solving now problem solving the first classes sunte aa rahe hoge so there is nothing new here but you need to think about it from the fact that the amount of money that you will make directly corresponds to the number of problem or the complexity of the problems that you will solve in your life if you develop highly niche skills for example abhi ai ka bahut zamana chal raha hai artificial intelligence that's a niche skill not many people know about it so if you develop that that's a high money making skill so to say similarly if you pick something in finance that's a high money making skill so to say so problem solving one aspect that we understand is the skill part now ye sab ko samajh mein aata hai but see what exactly is problem solving it is the ability to generate insights on the solution now that is a much better definition of what problem solving means now how do you cultivate insights or how do you become more insightful well it is by absorbing more complex information now if you study the world sitting in 2024 right now what is happening is that people are consuming over simplified stuff ki bhai sab spoon feed kar do panch stock se naam bata do we'll go and buy those only or you know what just tell us like you know this very basic book iski summary de do we'll just would do that or we'll just scroll through instagram reel what are you doing you are dumbing down your brain unless you start consuming more complicated stuff be it like long form content or reading dense books it is extremely unlikely 
that you will be able to analyze complex information and develop insights or in short you will be able to develop those problem solving skills the next skill that i will recommend you is that you need to learn investing formally now i keep on recommending that now you'll say of course you are a finance youtuber you will talk about investing this that see guys think about it from a macroeconomics point of view you yourself do the analysis you yourself will see one very clear trend that the debt on the world is rising like anything we are sitting on the highest debt levels ever in the human history so to say take a look at what has happened in venezuela take a look at what has happened in argentina argentina mein 100 100% inflation hai why because the debt is so high debt impacts something called as inflation or prices of commodities goods that you buy or daily things that you consume so how do you protect yourself from inflation well by learning investing now i am not pushing you that you should do stock investing or bond investing or real estate investing or gold investing bhai aapne jo samajh mein aata hai wo aap wo karo but the important point is that learn the basics of investing at least understand that it is critical for you to manage your own health and manage your own wealth just because you have access to a doctor does not mean ki unki health ki responsibility ho gayi aapki ki you know bimar padenge doctor to theek kar hi dega similarly don't treat your wealth the same way you are spending i don't know 80 90% of your working life just making money at least spend like 10% of your life in terms of learning how to manage that money it's very very critical so on that note what is the step 1 that i would suggest you in terms of investing or learning about investing it's very simple that you must start learning a investing not trading so understand the difference between the two that investing means ki aapne achhi cheeze pakad li right you buy good assets you buy it at a good price and you stay put for a little while your goal is not ki main flip karke paisa kama lunga your goal is buying good solid assets which have good business value so learn about investing in case you are interested i do run courses i do offer a member community you guys can check the details in the description and comment box and if you are a serious investor i would really recommend you to join it the feedback has been excellent so far and i am true really pushing hard to make wisdom hatch the number one investment community in india right now and we are gaining good number of members so hopefully we'll be able to build a very rich ecosystem that would allow you to learn from each other so see you can learn all the skills in the world but it will not help you translate those skills into money if you a cannot take risk and if you are not comfortable dealing with uncertainty लोगों को शोर शॉट गारंटी चाहिए होती है कि यार टेल अस लाइक टू स्टॉक्स दैट विल 100 परसेंट गिव रिटर्न देर इज नो सच थिंग एज 100 परसेंट देर इज नेवर बीन सच अ थिंग एज 100 परसेंट देर इज ऑलवेज अ लेवल ऑफ रिस्क दैट यू विल हैव टू टेक न मोस्ट पीपल आर स्केर टू टेक रिस्क फॉर टू रीजन द फर्स्ट की रीजन इज दैट दे कीप ऑन लुकिंग फॉर हंड्रेड परसेंट डेटा कि हमें आज ये स्टॉक खरीदना है एंड अनलेस वी गेट लाइक हंड्रेड परसेंट इन्फॉर्मेशन ऑन दिस एंटायर टॉपिक देन ओनली वी आर गोइंग टू टेक एक्शन See guys we live in the real world there is a lot of gaps in terms of the information that is there so at best for buying anything or investing in stock ho gaya ghar ho gaya whatever you are putting your money starting a business making a career move you will not get more than like 70 80% of information even if you do a phd on it so you will have to make concrete practical decisions based on limited data information otherwise you will go mad from that angle so this is one fact of life the second fact of life is that people are scared to take risks because they do not have a game plan or an action plan now let me explain it through my own example so i am sitting in goa right now i have shifted here when i shifted i started buying a lot of properties here so people said yaar you are an outsider how are you buying properties illegal nahi hoti property khareedni this that tumhe dar nahi lagta ye sab karne mein and all that stuff see again you have to deal with uncertainty i went about in a systematic manner in terms of mitigating my risk for example i spoke with a lot of people saw a lot of properties understood the perspective of buying properties of outsiders when they came and shifted to goa and purchase properties from there spoke with lawyers build my contacts wagera wagera so i did a lot of ground work before making my first purchase so that is the prep that i did in order to mitigate the uncertainties that were there now full proof guarantee hai ki whatever i am going to buy here i am going to 100% make profits on it no it is not like that but i learned how to deal with uncertainty so that i could take action and i was only able to take action because i had a game plan in mind and i could execute those steps so with that said let's move on so the next point is that you must cultivate the ability to study and understand macro trends or macro points unfortunately we live in such a complicated world and so many things are changing be it in the form of career be it in the form of investing world be it in the form of how the global structures are changing you need to understand macro economics or just generally macro trends and everything jaise education mein macro trend chal raha hai right i mean these days people are considering homeschooling their kids i am homeschooling my kid so many people question kya होम स्कूलिंग क्यों कर रहे हो राइट आई मीन कांट यू डू लाइक समथिंग एल्स ऐसा थोड़ी होता है सी गाइज द वर्ल्ड चेंजेस देर फॉर 
cultivating where you need to direct your efforts how do you decide that that is by understanding macro trends so again coming back to that homeschooling while example why is it that i am homeschooling my kid okay because i truly feel that the quality of teachers have gone down massively since the time i used to be in school right these days as a kuch bhi nahi hai ki hai na bahut acche you know teachers or well trained teachers are teaching it nothing of that sort previously teaching used to be a noble profession people used to spend a lot of time effort in terms of teaching their students but nothing of that sort is happening right that's a second the curriculum that is there in schools it has become too formal in a way political ki yaar yeah so that does not encourage critical thinking lot of missing skills are there right for example finance nahi padhai jati right uh, business building nahi padhai jati practicality nahi hai so much infrastructure pressure is there so much pressure on kid is there so lot of problems are there so you need to study macro trends on top of that lot of positive changes have happened similarly in career space there is a macro trend similarly in investing space there is a macro trend so now comes the question that how do you cultivate your ability to analyze these macro trends see first and foremost i will highly recommend you that you learn macroeconomics it really helps right you start seeing the world in broad buckets so to say on top of that the step 2 i will recommend in terms of macro trends is that start having opinions and start thinking on spectrums right for example man lo ki made in india initiative i right then think about it that how is it going to benefit india right and what are the negatives of it don't just weigh on one side of the things once you start analyzing all these broad broad things that analytical skill will get honed that ability to study macro trends will get honed and you will become a much more knowledgeable risk taker so to say so the next skill that will allow you to make a lot of money is your ability to learn things fast now this is very interesting because i can tell you a personal story here so when i was younger right when i was it must be in like class 6 7th 8th i was really bad at learning i used to retain stuff really well once i learned it but in terms of learning mujhe bahut time lagta tha cheeze seekhne mein and that was very very frustrating also then i eventually realized that with time i got better in terms of learning now why did that happen now that's a question that i kept on trying to investigate year on year year on year and probably ye cheez mujhe 25 sabse saal hai 25 26 i started to realize this better why was i able to transform that well the reason was then i was able to structure things really well after i became a management consultant so in management consulting they tell you how to structure things now what is the meaning of structured thinking so let me present a very simple case study so let us say that if you have to answer the question that why do you think that india's cricket is doing so well right now that's a question that's a complicated question so to say ab log us pe kya karenge people will just go on a rant and then they will speak paragraph after paragraph now you can basically categorize right at least in your brain you can categorize into finance factors and non finance factors so that is one layer of structuring right so finance mein for example jaise ki ipl hota hai right so that brings in a lot of money now what are other financial perks so perks are given those are financial perks for uh, the players that they make a lot of money especially when engaged rehte hain you bring in like from a players point of view bring like international players so is tarike se aap factor listing kar rahe ho on the uh, finance and non finance side now i'm not writing down the complete framework i'm just trying to tell you what is the meaning of structures so if you structure things really well then you can learn things really really fast right and which in turn improves your ability to comprehend now reading comprehension karke aapne sections hona hoga on cat exam gmat exam tofl all this stuff usme kya hota hai usme you are given a big paragraph teen char panch big paragraph de dete hain you have to read it really fast and answer questions people who do well on rce so for example i did exceptionally well on my gmat 99th percentile the mere and all that stuff so i was able to do well on this section why because i was good here right so this is where the story starts this is a skill that you need to pick the next point is that one of the key skills that people need to cultivate to make money is their ability not to get distracted there is so much flow of information there is so much so many things that are floating around you are constantly getting distracted from your phone so had do riya now this is just not my opinion in fact if you look at the scientific studies that have been done somewhere in 2012 i think the attention span of humans was roughly 12 seconds something like that now it is close to like 7 and a half 8 seconds ke aas pass so our attention span has fallen below goldfish right which is a really worrisome sign this is a negative sign for the next generation so if you have younger brother sister kids try to teach them not to get distracted that itself would allow you to do well now what is the number one skill or actionable point that i see here is that if you just figure out a way to limit your phone usage i think that adds a lot in terms of not getting distracted so for example i 
am moving away from smartphones entirely so whatever content i watch i watch it on my laptop i do not do it on my phone that simple switch has allowed me to save a lot of my time and that is something that i would encourage to my kids so in order to make money one thing that you need to focus very critically on is to gain a range of experience now just to illustrate my own story so for example when i worked in politics i was a speech writer and uh, say my writing got improved then when i walked into management consulting my structuring got improved now because i was a management consultant i analyze businesses wagera wagera so my investing skills got improved i am on youtube where i'm communicating all day so to say so say kya hua that by understanding business management consulting experience writing ka experience bunch of other different things running my own startups ka experience all this allows me now to analyze businesses much better right so what do i have i have a range of experiences right so this is an important point of course har koi kehta hai ki yaar aapko experience gather karne chahiye experience gather karne chahiye yes but there are layers to different experiences for example when you go and gain international experience be it in the form of studying or working abroad the type of experience that you will get will be very very different now this is something that i witnessed when i was studying at insead that interacting with people from different nationalities wo alag duniya lagti hai so to say right second is that you gain intensive experiences by working on something or running something for example i built startups i ran that a to z sare kaam main karta tha usme so on that that was an intensive experience this is very different from the type of experience i had here on top of that there are experiential learning opportunities these are like नो लो लेवल टच बेस पॉइंट टाइप ऑफ एक्सपीरियंस की जैसे मान लो आप वियतनाम घूमने चले गए नाउ देर डिड यू गेन अ न्यू एक्सपीरियंस येस वॉज इट वेरी इंटेंस द शॉर्ट आंसर इज नो ऑल दीज थ्री हैव वेरी डिफरेंट थिंग्स एंड हाउ दे कॉन्ट्रीब्यूट टू योर ओवरऑल लर्निंग यू मस्ट अप्लाई दिस कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ कंसेंट्रिक सर्कल थियोरी इट मीन्स दैट फॉर एग्जाम्पल देर वुड बी टाइम्स वेन यू विल हैव वेरी इंटेंस एक्सपीरियंसेज राइट इसमें इमर्सिव होती है कि फॉर एग्जाम्पल एक महीना आई एम गोइंग टू लर्न लाइक कोडिंग and i'm going to write like for 30 day challenge i'll pick it up i'll do it for 30 days or i'll exercise for 30 day that is a type of an intensive experience or i will run a startup that's an intensive experience so you must try to get experiences which fall here right because if you gain these type of experiences which are very high value so to say high target wale they will subsume these type of slightly lower ticket kind of experiences so that's the critical point that you must understand ki aapko na high level experience thode se gain karne chahiye that's a वॉट एंड अप हैपनिंग इज दैट पीपल गेट ओवर वेल सो वहाँ पे कंसेंट्रिक सर्कल वाली चीज आती है कि आप धीरे धीरे करके चीजें लर्न करोगे फर्स्ट यू विल लर्न समथिंग अराउंड हियर राइट देन यू विल मेक अ जंप हियर देन यू विल मेक अ जंप हियर इफ यू ट्राई टू जंप डायरेक्टली फ्रॉम हियर टू हियर इट बिकम्स लाइक एन इशू राइट एंड समटाइम्स यू विल गेट ओवर वेल राइट सो ऑन दैट नोट ट्राई टू थिंक अबाउट दिस कंसेंट्रिक सर्कल फ्रॉम बोथ दीज पॉइंट दैट आई स्पोकन अबाउट एंड लेट्स मूव ऑन टू द नेक्स्ट पॉइंट या द नेक्स्ट इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट इन टर्म्स ऑफ योर वेल्थ बिल्डिंग जर्नी दिस ईयर वुड बी योर एबिलिटी टू बिल्ड डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन ना वट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन मीन्स दैट इफ यू आर स्टार्टिंग अ बिजनेस राइट एंड इफ यू हैव टू गेट द वर्ड आउट फॉर दैट बिजनेस लेट्स अज्यूम दैट यू स्टार्ट अ कॉफी शॉप एंड आपको मार्केटिंग करनी है राइट सो वॉट विड यू डू प्रोबली यू विल गो एंड हायर इन्फ्लुएंसर्स यू विल गिव अ न्यूज पेपर एड यू विल रन अ रेडियो एड और वट एवर इट इज और यू विल स्टिक फ्लायर्स वॉट नॉट राइट सो गेटिंग द वर्ड आउट इज डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन now we live in very interesting times that platforms like linkedin youtube twitter these are all free distribution platform it's not as if that you have to pay linkedin money in order to generate content or pay youtube money in order to generate content so to say so having that distribution is critical if you are trying to build a business or if you are trying to build a personal brand so therefore at least getting an understanding of how to begin in this category is critical is it simple to build distribution no it's extremely difficult now it is getting costlier to build distribution few years down the line it will be extremely expensive to own a distribution or build a distribution so to say if you are starting out so wo sab problems to rahengi but if you feel ki acha theek hai i see value in terms of building distribution what is it that i should do then step one according to me should be that you start talking about things that you enjoy talking about so let's say that you are a cricket enthusiast and you have certain level of insights in that then you can start speaking about it on linkedin you can start speaking about it on youtube and see how the journey transpires don't take it from a money making perspective the money in distribution might take years but figure out what you enjoy doing and start talking a little bit more about that so all the skills that i have spoken about today they all come together and would allow you to do something which is called as business building 
in order to run a business you need to have different variety of skills analytical ability problem solving dealing with uncertainty investing how to manage your company's money how to put it for growth so all these skills come together and they give you something called as business skill hum log kai baar sochte hain ki entrepreneurship sikha do now what is entrepreneurship well entrepreneurship is a collection of all these different set of skills that i have spoken about in this video so far now definitely building a business is really powerful if you know how to scale a business there is nothing like that aapne kai baar suna bhi hoga ki aap business mein bahut acha paisa banate ho definitely banate hain but it's also very difficult to do because the amount of uncertainty that you will have to deal with it's just unreal it's very very unlikely that you will just get up one day quit your job and start a business some people are able to do it but most of us are not so if you have watched this video till this point i am hopeful that some of the skills that i have spoken about they would allow you to become a better entrepreneur you can start practicing these skills and that can create a massive impact in your life so i hope that you enjoyed this video and i'll see you soon